hear that? That's a rally. What? Welcome to FBR. We're at the middle of everywhere rally in Hayfield. As you can see, there's a smorgasbord of rally cars here today. We've got people who have showed up in their cars, the people who trailed it, and people, big transporters. It's gonna be an absolute cracker of a day, and I need a coffee. I'm here with Andrew and Richard, and this is a proper rally car. How on earth does this go against the all-wheel drive boys? Ah, uh, well, it's got no en near enough traction, so they're always going to beat you, but I'll make it up in skids and power. You obviously are the happiest man when you get out of a stage. Yeah. Uh, actually, we're the happiest man when we finish a stage. But yeah, we're proud of you. It was the first car that caught my eye when I got here because it's so different. This is, is it the only Commodore here? Today it is. Well, there was one more Commodore, but he's bailed out because he had a some sort of face issue or something. Okay. I normally drive mine, he drives his, so we've both got to win or compete, but mine's uh, at home because I'm navigating him today for some stupid reason, so. So you're gonna help him get points? Help him uh, get lost. Oh, okay, yeah, that's what I would <laughs> say. You turn left here and get yeah, totally. brothers and there is such a thing called the McNay Cup and at the end of the year whoever wins wins the McNay Cups. So two questions one who's winning the cup <laughs> <laughs> so it's like uh, you know the points don't matter kind of deal. It's good for a laugh and you know <laughs> and uh, well I was gonna ask what's the final prize what do you actually apart from the bragging rights yeah, and fair enough a classic hand trophy that we found somewhere some I can't remember something with a bit of text on it. Actually, no, it's a coffee cup with a bit of text on it. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> oh, there you go. All this time and all this effort for a coffee cup. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sounds viable to me. Sounds like rallying to me. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. No, thank, thank you, you very much. much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Ah, good luck. Thank you. I'm here with Grant McKillop from Grant McKillop Photography. Are you busy? I'm not busy. Oh, you're not busy. I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm busy. You're not busy, but you've got that in your hands. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, I am busy. I'm flat out. Yeah. Yeah. You, you've been flat out doing a lot of other stuff too. Yeah. Like there's been. We were saying you've done. You just did lawnmower racing. Is that where? No, you were? I didn't get to the lawnmower racing. I did the six hour enduro at Golden Beach. Yep. Uh, the supercars down at Phillip Island and the two liter super sedans. And the power boats down at Painesville. I'm just trying to get to as many events as possible. We're going to start carpooling with this guy, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys live closer to the hill climb than I do. <laughs> so where are you based? Uh, out of sale. Oh yeah, well, that's all right. Well, we'll see you when we go to the sale uh, hill climb. Yeah, at, the the raft, at the raft base. At the raft base? Yeah. Are they starting to have that again, are they? It's, it's coming up, yes. Yeah, nice. So, yeah, hopefully we'll see you there. Yeah. 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 All good? Awesome. All right? Huh? No worries, it's great to meet you. Good you too. <laughs> Right two. <laughs> 
with Glen Raymond and a fantastic Hyundai XL. Tell us all about it. Pretty is finest, to be honest. <laughs> so uh, this is actually my brother Matt's XL. We're doing the course car, so zero car zero, which goes 10 minutes before the first car, just to clear through the final clear. So yes, he's been driving this, he's had it for about 10 years, and the first time I'm gonna have a punt, so he's to go driving. He's still gotta go pretty fast, because the guys at the front are gonna be coming up, only 10 minutes behind, they can catch up. Yeah, it's a good car, front wheel drive, still standard, but it's got some really good shocks. They're strong, and ironically, they, they actually go all right. I mean, it looks like a standard XL. Like, let's be honest, it's it looks like an XL with, with, with different wheels under it. So it's kind of, yeah, that's fantastic. Yeah, so basically you get an XL. This one, so you've got to keep them relatively standard. So it's got a standard motor, but he's blueprinted it and rebuilt it. Um, you know, it's got the biggest thing is the shocks. It's got these ones called uh, MCAs. So they're 40 mil shocks, adjustable. And they're what make the car pretty much, is you can just really send it to wherever you want. And obviously the safety gear and the roll cage and all the rest, and um, a few bars to hold on to just in case. <laughs> <laughs> so 10 minutes before everybody else, so you're basically the Rue Dodger. Yeah, and there's a couple of Rues out here, to be, to be fair. So more tomorrow is what I'm worried about. So I'll, um, I'll just maybe just sit on the horn. Take me back to when I was 18. <laughs> <laughs> it, it really, honestly, this is, you know, this is entry level, isn't it? Like for, for rallying. Yeah, yeah. So there is a one mate control series, of, just like the circuit racing. It actually was in rallying beforehand. So there's quite a fair few cars like this, then it excels. And to be honest, they're, they're quick. Like people are getting in the top 10 the state level. One guy actually set a third fastest state time against directors and Evos and, you know, escorts and all the rest. So that was at night. But, you know, they're just here to be sent. When I started, I started in a 1.3 litre Corolla and everyone else had all these really fast Datsuns on the list, but I think I learned more driving a slower car than trying to jump into a fast car. So you are quite disciplined. You've got to pick the line, you've got to make sure you're in the grip, a little bit more committed here and there, and then, yeah, when you go into a faster car, it's, um, it just all translates. And the front wheel drive is fine. Like yeah. I, know, I know a lot of people who get into rally and everyone wants to just, you know, be like in that little Corolla there, just spit rocks everywhere and have a great time. But a front wheel drive is good. Uh, you'd be surprised how sideways they are. And you can put them on bigger angles and you can hold it. Yeah. That's that's the, probably the difference. People think they're boring, but when you're hammering it, they're actually quite quite exciting. Nothing's going to be like a real drive, but you could spend 100 grand on an Escort. You could spend $1 on an XL. That was fantastic. All right. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you. Nine right on for our time. 50. So all the cars are coming in after doing their stages. They've actually got half an hour to only work on their cars to change tires, brakes, whatever they need to change. Then they stage here, wait for everybody else to come. It's an hour and a half in between when they come in to when they go again, and we go racing. Basically, there's a whole lot of work to do. How are you going, Luke? Had an absolute ball. So we're actually on a borrowed car. Oh, nice. This isn't even our car. We've actually loaned it. So it's event. a rental. Yes, it is. A Rentals rental. are the fastest cars I've been told. Yeah, car. we are. They are definitely the fastest. We've actually uh, so we're building a new car. So this is the borrowed car that's not running today. So we're excellent. Enjoying. It's actually a really well built car, and we're slowly getting it competitive. It's actually performing really, really well. Well done, Motorsport, who have been absolutely fantastic. And, Looking after and preparing the car for us. A bit of a shout out. Yeah, yeah you got to do that. We're doing a car as well, or you got a car? We've or? got a few cars. Oh, right. Uh, Lucas Automated. Lucas Super Automated. specialist for the last 20 years in South East Melbourne, loving it. Excellent. Did you have enough time to pull up for the coffee from the Stag and Doe there? Oh, yeah. Stag and Doe. Yes, it is good. Yes. Yeah, we went back and Did stirred you? up Amy for lunch. Oh, yeah. good. That's a good place. Tell her we'll see her in the morning. Oh, <laughs> no, she's. She's opening up, she said she's opening up all weekend, yeah, four years. We'll be there. No, it's fantastic food. So, where about today? Where are you standing in the well, We're unsure because we haven't looked yet because we're more focused but on. That's your job? Care. No. No? My job's to tell him where to go. Okay, but He's I thought it was, you know, to have on the rally safe and do all the things. No, no, we haven't actually looked at that yet because we've been too busy trying to work on the car and no, actually fair enough. get it to where we've got to go to because we had way too much rear brake bias to start, so we've actually got to now to actually pull into the corner rather than slide around ridiculously left and right when yeah. you didn't expect it. How was that first triangle spectator stage there? How did it uh, go through there? We understeared through it. It was nicely. <laughs> Once we settled into it, yeah, the last two stages were a lot of fun. That last stage, 
So. Really, like Wayne did some amazing commitment to the corners and the notes, real high speed stuff. Which <laughs> oh, excellent. Really floating through the corners. And, now, so. you're going back through the same course again this afternoon. This afternoon, so really looking forward. Like, I write all the times down in my book, so I can give them a bit of a heads up of how yeah. we're going. Yeah, nice. So, expecting some improvements. Well, no worries. It looks like it's pretty cruisy. You kept it all nice and straight, which is yeah. nice. Yeah, because it's not our car, we definitely on the leaner side of the no, commitment level. Uh, yeah. I better bugger off and let you be and no do some work. Done, thank Have you very much for your time. Catch Enjoy up, your boy. What's up, bro? 120. Up the ball, 120. Left ball room and right through rough. Left ball room and right through rough, 60. Right through rough, 60. Short right. Short right, 880. Half right, seven. How good was that rally? Right in our backyard. I know, right? If you want us at FBR to promote your Gippsland motorsport event, shoot us a message on either Facebook, YouTube, anywhere, any of the socials, and we'll get in contact with you. We'll organise something, we'll put you on YouTube, and we'll get the word out. See you soon. Oh, sorry, I was about to say Cairns, but it's Motorsport Australia now. Same. Yeah, same. Same, same, different name. Same shit, different bucket. <laughs> you can't say that. I just, I just did. <laughs>